If you've misplaced or lost your iPhone or iPad, inside of every iPhone and iPad, there's an app that helps you locate it. Hopefully you have a couple of settings set on on your lost device so you could actually find it. So let me show you those settings first. Obviously, if you don't have your device, you'll have to use another device to locate that device. And if you don't have another device like an iPhone or iPad, I'll show you how to do this with a website too. But inside of the settings of your device, let me just show you how to turn it on. So just in case you have other devices, you should turn it on right now. If you click your name right on top, this should be where you are signing to iCloud. So that's one of the requirements for the lost device to be signed into iCloud. Click that. And there's a new option here. It's called Find My. You see that right here in the center? It used to be called Find My iPhone, but with iOS 13, they combined it with Find My Friends app. And now you could just click it here. And right on top, it says Find My iPhone. That's the section dedicated to finding your device. Click it. And these settings should be on. So find my iPhone has to be on on the lost device. So obviously, if you don't have your device, don't worry about it. I'll show you how to try to find it. Enable offline finding also should be on. So it doesn't need Wi-Fi or cell phone data to find it. And set my last location. I usually leave this on too, just in case your phone dies or the battery is critically low. It will send the location to Apple. So let's assume on your lost device, all these were turned on already and it was signed into iCloud. So now let's go ahead and try to find it. So on the homepage, just scroll down here. So you get this search bar right on top and just type in find my and the application should show up here. So you could go ahead and select it. If you don't see it, just go ahead and reinstall it from the app store. I'll select it. And on this page, you want to be under the device tab. You see the three different tabs on the bottom. You want to be in the devices one. That's going to show you all your devices sign into iCloud. So here I'm going to scroll up and it should show me all the devices that have find my enabled and are connected to iCloud. So in this case, I would look for my lost device on this list and I would go ahead and click it. And on this page, let's go ahead and scroll up. And here are your options. You could go ahead and play a sound. And if your device is nearby, you will hear that sound. You could also see the directions. So if it finds your device, it's going to show the directions icon. You could click that to see where it was left. But what's more important is these two options on the bottom. Mark as lost. If you activate this, it's going to let you lock your device here. And then if someone else has that device, they can't get into it. It would just lock that device here and the lost mode is activated. That's what this page does. There's another option. If you think your device is lost or someone has it that shouldn't have it, you should press erase this device. Hopefully you've backed this up already on the iCloud. So when you get a new device, you could just go ahead and back it up from there. But erasing this device option will wipe that device's memory and everything will be gone from that device. But if someone has it that shouldn't, that's your best bet. And what if you don't have another iPad or iPhone or access to another iOS device? Well, let me show you the website that lets you do it. It's also built into this app. So if someone else has this app, you could use their app. And on this app, you could go to the me option, the last option in the corner. And if you slide up here, there's an option called help a friend. You could click that on someone else's phone and it brings you to iCloud.com. You'll need to sign into iCloud with your Apple ID. You could also do this on the computer. It's the same exact place, iCloud.com. Type in your Apple ID, type in your password, and I'll show you the next step. And iCloud.com looks very much like the Find My app. So you'll see all your devices here. Click on the lost one. You have simple three options that you had on the app. You could play the sound that will play that loud sound. So if your phone is nearby, you'll hear it. You could do the lost mode. That's the activating the lost mode, which will lock your phone and set up a lost message. And you could go ahead and erase your phone again. If you think it's lost for good, that's the option that you should select. Or if you think it's in someone's hand, that shouldn't be go ahead and do erase phone. And in the beginning of the video, when I showed you the three different settings that the phone should have, hopefully if those were turned on, even if the phone died or it didn't have internet connection, you still have access to finding it that way. Hopefully one of these options solves your problem. Please subscribe to this channel for easy to follow tech videos posted every single day and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.